Hello everyone, I'm Farrell and welcome to I'm Still Here. This is, uh, this is supposedly a horror game that I found on itch.io. Itch yeah, that's it. So, apparently I have my own little apartment here. Okay, that's that's weird. When I look around or try to look around, it's blurry. I'm, I'm sorry about that. Um, you. Ah, finally moving into my new place. A chance to start a new life. Alright. What's wrong with that? The landlord seems a little weird about this place, but I don't have time to worry about that. Psh, nah. Not at all. This place is probably haunted, full of demons. Don't, don't have time to worry about that shit. And you finish putting those books away. Oh! Oh my god. The, uh... The, uh, mouse sens sensitivity is really high on this game. And the thing is, there's no menu. Like, as soon as I popped into the game, it brought me to this. So, it, oh god. I barely tapped on my mouse and it just went, Phew! Okay, see, when I click escape to try to go to a menu, it just says quit game, so, no. So, I have to deal with really high... That's not the right button. There it is. So apparently I'm putting this book, these books away. Maybe get closer. Oh. <laughs> Probably hope if I clicked out of the dialogue. Oh god, this mouse sensitivity! Oh, it's way too high, I wish I could change it. Alright, alright. Putting this, uh, putting these books away. One at a time, god damn this fucking sensitivity! Ugh. So, yeah. Putting books away. Let me closer. Makes it a little bit, little bit easier on myself. So far, nothing scary. As you count, putting books away is scary. Excuse me? Excuse me! Did I tell you you could fly off the shelf? No. I'm pretty sure I didn't. You're going back there. I already got a little bit of weird things. That or my books are alive. Okay, just putting these books away. This is the gameplay, apparently. Just unpacking your shit into a new place. Enjoying the game yet? This is fun, huh? God damn, this fucking sensitivity. Oh my god. Nothing against like the creators of the game or anything, but add a menu, like an option, so I can bring down the sensitivity a little bit. Oh, that's the scary part about this, the sens sensitivity of this game. Alright, well, we're almost done. What the heck? Why are my books moving? Yeah, exactly. Um, I need to figure out what's going on. Yeah, I think you probably should. I should ask the internet for help. When books fly off the shelf, like that, on their own, no explanation. First thing you think, I'm gonna Google this. So let's go over to the computer. Oh God, why? Ugh, just aim a little bit different. There we go. Okay, why don't my, okay, I gotta enter here. Why don't my parents want to talk to me? Why don't my bathroom lights work? Why don't my books stay on my shelf? Why don't my stuff stay still? I'm gonna say my parents. You should try calling your parents to make sure they aren't dead. What kind of a response is that? My parents talk to me. My mom and dad used to call me every day, but now they don't. So apparently they're dead. So, backspace. I don't my... Trying to find the keys without looking down. Bathroom lights work. Why don't my books stay on the shelf? Just throw your books away. You're reading. Wait. Reading is for nerds. Not reading. Reading. Okay. Backspace. Okay. How about my stuff? My s Why don't my stuff stay still? All my furniture keeps moving around on its own. What is wrong? You got a ghost, bro. 
need to perform an exorcism. Oh god. Okay. Oh snap, I think I have ghosts. Uh my book yeah, my books are definitely moving on their own again. Books, could you stop? Dot dot dot. Yeah, definitely ghosts. Yeah. I should ask the internet how to get rid of these these ghosts. Oh my god, this the fact that I had to get rid of the text by entering enter. Now I have to go back again. I didn't want to do that. My room is changing colors. It's a rave in here. I have. I have some dreams where I'm driving and brakes don't work. I have some booty stuff going on. Sounds like when my grandma had spirits messing with her. If you can get their attention, you can ask them to stop. Okay. So, try and get their attention. Hey! Ghost! Mr. Ghost! I'm trying to get your attention! Okay, okay. I'm sorry I yelled. I'm sorry. I, I literally moved on my own. That was not me. Okay. Trying to get their attention. Maybe if I fuck with the light? Maybe? Yes? No? No? Okay, um... Uh, okay, so I, I, I still have to get their attention somehow. Books are freaking the fuck out. Can I just put them back on the shelf? Nope, they just go straight to there. Okay. So apparently I have to get their attention somehow. Oh my god, these controls. That's the scary thing about this game. The controls. How do I... Do I print screen using a Mac? How do I delete my internet history? What have you been doing? How do I know if I'm being haunted? How do I keep things from moving? How do I get rid of ghosts? Well, I already know I'm haunted, so how do I get rid of ghosts? I read a book once that ghosts don't like it if you mess with the light switch. That's what I was trying to do! To mess with them! Hmm, that sounds promising. I should flip my lights on and off to annoy the ghosts. Yes, if you have ghosts, just flicker the shit out of your lights. Okay. Can I do it? Now I can do it. Let's turn it on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off. Is it doing it yet? Huh? Mr. Ghost? Or Mrs. Ghost? Whoa, okay, I just skipped some dialogue. I'm sorry about that. Who said that? Get out of my house. Where's the keys at? Goes, no way, this is my house. That being such a jerk. <laughs> Listen here, ghosts. I'm the one who fucking paid for this house. Apartment. I'm assuming it's apartment. I'm the one who paid for... Well, uh, it says house, so okay. I'm the one who paid for this house. You're just an unwanted guest. This is my house now. You must be dead. Well, no shit, he's a fucking ghost. Oh, wow, this is heavy. Yeah, pretty heavy. My spirit must be stuck here because my body still needs to be put to rest. You want me to grab a shovel for you? I'll bury you in the backyard. I'm a dead person buried in my backyard. As long as it gets rid of the ghost, I'll do it. That makes sense to me. Will you help me find my body then? Sure, if it'll get you to leave me alone. I don't know, having a ghost as a roommate would be pretty fun, I think. It'd fuck with you, you can fuck with your friends. I will find your body and put you to rest. 
Okay. Let's turn around here. Just very slowly. Now, if I were to hide a body, where would I put it? Hmm. If I were to hide a body, where would I put it? Well, honestly, I would put it in the backyard, but since we can't go to the backyard, my first instinct after that would be the fridge. No! Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, Jesus. Stop that. Oven? No. Are you in the walls? Maybe if you told me... Well, I guess he doesn't know where his body is. I have a nice bed. Better bed than I have. Jeez. Okay, so there's nothing in here. Oh my god, oh my god, mouse. I gotta remember to... Hello? Oh my god, these mouse, the mouse that's... Titty, hello? Body? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> okay, so it's not in the bedroom. It's underneath the table. In the bathroom? I mean, it's worth a shot, I guess. And the tub. There's no way you can fit a whole human body in a toilet. Even if you grind it up in a blender, there's no way in hell. That's my... Hey, that's me. You found me. Are you fucking kidding me? You're telling me I am being haunted by the ghost of a fish. Someone who lived here previously found their goldfish dead put it in the toilet and forgot to flush and now they're haunt now the fish is haunting what Whew. okay I'll, I'll i'll bite get it <laughs> hey that's me you found me that's how i died Wow, this is heavy. Yeah, it is my little ghost fish friend. Well, can you help me move on so I can stop haunting this place? I'll finally put you to rest, little buddy. Let's flush it down the toilet. Flush our little ghost friend buddy down the toilet. He was so young. I'm free. Be free, my little fish buddy. Be free. <laughs> Rest in peace, little buddy. Rest in peace. I'll always remember you. The time you knocked the books off my shelf. The time you called me a jerk. <sighs> Good times. Good times. Is that it? You want to have a peaceful night and live comfortably in your new apartment? See, now it says apartment. Before he said house. An apartment is not a house. A house can be in a can be divided into apartments, but a house is not an apartment. So it is an apartment. You're just fucking with my head now. But you can never shake the memory of your little friend. You occasionally take a peek in the toilet and dream of finding them there again. See? Should I have him as a roommate? Having a fish as a... old well, dead fish's ghost as a roommate would have been fun. Pull pranks on your friends, relatives that you don't like, your girlfriend's mother when she comes over. <sighs> but all you find in the bowl is emptiness. Just like my soul. Occasionally there's a turd if you forget to flush earlier. <laughs> yeah, that tends to happen. That end. <sighs> I'm still here. Okay, so that was I'm Still Here. Very short game. It's it was a little creepy at first. It was a little creepy especially when like the ghost shut up telegram. Especially when the ghost like pushed me back. 
when I stood up. That scared the shit out of me. I'm like, okay, we're dealing with something serious here. And then I found out it's a ghost of a dead fish in a toilet. Yeah. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and a comment down below. It's always appreciated. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, subscribe. It is free, and who doesn't love free things? And as always, I'll see you all in the next video.